Next, latest data presets. Uh, this feature is helpful, uh, especially when you're working with data that it's not necessarily related to today, right? You know, sometimes you have data source that bring data that, are, that is old, days old, weeks old, months old, or maybe data that is in the future. Like, you know, when is going to be, when is the, the, the last expected shipping date from your orders? You, you don't know if it's this month, last month. It's just like the latest. In before version 10.3, you know, seeing the latest um, 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 date uh, was, you know, you have to do a little bit of massage and understand how to use the right features to get the latest date. Now it's so much easier. Uh, this feature is only available in, in filters using the desktop. So what I'm going to show you here now is I have here a sample database where I have uh, all descending orders. So I have at the top of this list, the latest date. So 2017, July, and the latest date is July 28th. And then, you know, just showing that it goes back to older data. So if I only want to see the latest uh, date available, what I do is I take the, you know, this is invoice date. I take invoice date, drag and drop into my filters, select any of these time buckets, let's say I want to select month, day, and year, click next, and now I can choose this new checkbox. This is the novelty. Filter to latest date value when workbook is open. So click this one, and I think I have to refresh my data source here. Let's see if that fixes it. There you go. So when I click OK now, what's going to do is it's going to show me only the last date. Whatever happened the last day is not the, not today, not yesterday is the last date. Now let me do it again to show a variation. Drag and drop. I'm going to select now month and year. And what's going to happen is in my in my sample database, the last month and year is July. So when I click OK, it's only going to show July, nothing else. So this is a new feature, very, very, very helpful when you're trying to find the latest date in a data set, regardless of you know, what the data is.